Hello, everybody. How we doing? How we doing? My name is Quantic Flux, and today we're going to be playing the demo for a game called Union of Gnomes. Uh, it's a roguelike deck builder where you rise up and fight the oppressive regime of Snow White. So, without further ado, let's check it out. Ooh. Boom. Story is about to begin. Boom. Brothers, come on. All together now. Crack. Guys, run. Run. Freedom. Nothing and no one will keep the gnomes behind bars. Hell yeah, brother. Union of gnomes. All right, we're right in there. Uh, I guess I'm choosing sweet pie. I have a talent point. Uh, you certainly look like a ranged person. Okay. Oh boy, I don't know what any of this stuff means. Sure. We're a vampire gnome. <laughs> uh, okay, let's head in, I suppose. Oh, oh, sorry. Radar. This is the headquarters. Heroes of the gnomes gather here. Each of them has its own team, the starting squad. Each hero has its, his own strengths, weaknesses, and talents. The hero you choose, you will go on a mission. Come by here more often, chief. After all, new heroes come to our camp all the time. Got it. Okay. That's a different version of the guy we got. Fighters, sure, sure, sure. Tactics, cool. Okay. Uh, House of Gnomes. The House of Gnomes, or as we call it, the dorm. Here you can meet all the gnomes of our camp and find out who can do what. When we free the gnomes of the entire kingdom, we'll definitely throw a big party here. Sounds fun. Good job, Raider. Uh, barracks, graveyard. Uh-oh. <laughs> graveyard is empty, thankfully. It's the barracks. Here we gather our squad for a mission. Here you can assemble a hero's starting squad of ten fighters. You will go on a mission with them. After winning the battles, new vo gnome volunteers will join the squad, but this starting squad right here is the basis of your hero's army. It will form his tactics. Each hero has his own starting squad, but you can change it here. Got it. Okay. So, I assume that the ones with arrows are ranged. Um, yeah, I'm not sure. Why don't we head in? Onward. Uh, Nomen Tanamo Prison. Nice. Psst, Commander, just be quiet. The mice whispered to me that Snow White's speaker had arrived in the village and was preparing to make a speech. Let's hear it. Peek out of the bushes. Speaker Lumen. In the name of her top chart highness, a squad of fugitive gnome criminals is hiding in these lands. Without her top pop song charms, they are very dangerous. But keep calm. Three loyal assistants of her marvelous voice, the Leather Lord, Madam and General I, are already ventured to hunt for these filthy rats. Who's that? This is Lumen, Snow White's speaker, the mouthpiece of enemy propaganda. Nasty guy. But since the Leather Lord, Madam, and General I are hunting for you, it means that you have managed to really piss off Snow White. That they're her best gnome hunters. Scout reported that in the forest in the north, you will be able to hide and continue the uprising. Got it. It's time to leave. A group of rebellious gnomes have escaped from Nomantamno Bay. Or sorry, prison. Sorry. It's definitely not Guantanamo Bay. Um, the humans are searching all over the land for the escapees who dared to break Snow White's spell. We have sent three of our best hounds to find them, Leatherlord, Madam, and General I. The fugitives break free from their encirclement. A gnome uprising and revolution will sweep the entire kingdom. Go gnomes. We love revolutions in this channel. These are the patrols. <laughs> Bro, nice. This is the, there are patrols of local peasants and Snow White's hunters snooping all over the dusk wood. The only safe place we can rest and practice are the hideouts. I mark them on our route with sausages. 
Good job, bro. Okay, what do we got here? Um, is there a legend? There is not. Okay, no problem. Uh, in my experience, gnomes like books. So, let's go to a book. Why not? Battle? 15 sausages, I suppose. Okay. This is our deck, I suppose, and this is the hero. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing. That's okay, though. We got three mana. Gives one mana if hero has armor. Heals three HP. Okay, cool. Stretch two random gnomes. It gives two mana. Don't need ya. Well, seven damage if it hits. Sorry, if it crits. Applies poison times three. Okay. Six armor and mark one. I do wish there was, like, a... Uh, if you hovered over these guys, they told you what Mark and Poison did. That would be super useful. Um, if six armor and Mark one can be applied to enemies, is Mark bad? I don't know. Let's shoot. You look like a healer. Let's shoot you. Twice. Okay. And I guess... I don't know if we want Mark. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know. Enter. I see that there's a question mark here now. I should probably see what that does. Mark, hero receives crit damage. Okay, that was not the correct thing to do, as it turns out. Uh, I have screwed our run. <laughs> Um, okay. Ah, mana does not regenerate on its own. That's good to know. Okay. Deals two damage if target has armor, gives hero dodge. What is this? Weak. Increases damage. Nice. Gives one mana if hero has armor, heals three HP. Rip. Is there a way to discard? No? Okay. Sure. You... Do seem to heal like I suspected. We're gonna get one mana. And boy oh boy, things are going poorly for us. Why don't we save our mana? Yeah, you are a healer. <laughs> okay. has armor heals three hp i don't have armor okay we're going to hack you here because we have no other choice slingshot you i can't help but notice you're not applying poison we're going to do this and can i get this for i can okay cool Okay, I'm getting poisoned. <laughs> Next one range gnome deals crit. Sure. Uh, two to do that. Or we could do crit on everything. No. I think we're dying, to be honest. Okay, let's do this. Blast you. You're dead. We healed because I did a ranged attack. Um, and let's hit you. You're, again, not doing poison. Am I missing something here? Okay. Wolf. Yeah, we're big dead. Okay. We're not off to a great start. Let's try again. Sorry, sweet pie. Three gnomes can be added to the starting squad. Okay, sure. 
All right. What do we got this time? Hero doesn't select it. Nice. Uh, we got you. You also have a talent. Next enemies with poison restores 10% of the damage dealt. Okay. I still kind of think vampire is the best one. Ooh. Okay. Try again. probably gets us a no so sure let's go down this path okay this fight seems significantly easier than the one we picked last time um let's see we could Arkia. We could slingshot ya. We could get a mana. We could blast the crap out of ya. And we could get more mana. Okay. You're dead. <laughs> Much better start. Okay, choose one volunteer to add to your party. Is immune to all enemies and debuffs them. This seems good. Okay. How do we get more sausages? Because I see it's costing us some to travel every time. And it looks like the more cards we add, the more cost to travel. Uh, okay, this fight seems harder. we got here let's armor you up blast you slingshot and then i guess it doesn't really matter we're getting up to full either way you guys all seem to be buffing yourselves okay Uh, let's do this. You're not dead. That's a huge bummer. And I suppose we'll end with two man or one mana. Ah, you died from poison. I'd love to see it. Okay, you are doing an insane amount of damage. Let's mark ya, attack ya, blast ya, and then heal. What does it mean? Not receive buffs or debuffs. Ah, you were healing yourself, not doing damage. Okay, no problem. In fact, you healed the goat. All right. I guess we do this first. Okay, sure. And I can either do eight damage or seven damage. But if we crit, it does the poison, so it blasts. Okay, we don't really want to kill things with poison because we heal if we kill them with ranged. So, back, kill you to heal. Right. Self some mana. Heal. I think we save our mana since that's not gonna crit. Ouch.
Okay, I see. I see. Heal because he's not attacking. Got it. And I guess just this. All right. What do we got here? You're buffing yourself. We attack you. We blast you. Blast you again. And then we play these both to get back to full mana. Oh, armor lasts more than one turn. Good to know. Okay. So, first things first. Play you. Play you. Well, now knowing that armor lasts more than one turn, I don't want to play two armor on him. How about we try this, I guess, and hope that it lasts the next turn? We're about to find out, I suppose. It did not. <laughs> Okay. This man is healing again. Okay, what do we do here? We mark ourselves. We get armor to heal. Attack. And it's not going to crit, so we save our mana. Eighteen damage, you say? Wow. Huh. Okay. Okay. We will discard two. Of course, <laughs> he discarded what I didn't want to discard. That's fine. It's fine. We got this. Eventually, we got this. Okay. You're healing again. We pass this. We have armor, so we get a dodge. Or not. We heal. Slingshot twice. Target has armor. Gives zero damage. Got it, got it, got it. Last ya. And then we finish you. Okay. Okay. I'm starting to get the hang of it. I got it. The seven damage if he heals critical hit gives two mana. That's pretty good. Scar the Gnome and gives eight armor. Also pretty good. Scar the Gnome for me hand and applies poison five. That's also pretty good. All these gnomes are pretty good. I'm going to go with OK Boomer though because he's got a funny name. All right. On to the next one. Very much getting concerned about a lack of sausages. Okay. Okay. Here's what we do. Spotter. Okay, Boomer. Two man. Yeah, two mana back. That makes sense. We... we actually give ourselves a bunch of armor ah now mark's gonna last two turns uh-oh <laughs> okay that's not great okay we heal we Yeah. Might as well. We discard. Okay. So we mark you. Blast you. 
Get our mana back. Get you here. Get you here. Get our mana back. Hmm. Not great. Yeah, pretty bad, I'd say. I don't know how much damage Mark for science. Crit? I don't know. Um, sure. Give me immune, I guess. Discard. Okay, let's see how much damage you take. You got six armor. You're doing eight damage. Seven. So must be a fifty percent, I guess. Okay. Die. Thank you. I was drunk too. Yeah, I really wish there were tool tips to see what um what this meant. I think we grabbed the juggler. Ooh, hookster is free though. Juggler does just a boatload of damage, though. I can't help but notice that there's not a skip option, by the way. Um, so every time we travel, we're losing more and more sausages because each card we add eats food. Gathering place for rebel gnomes. Here you can hire mercenaries and buy artifacts. Just 10 armor. Sure, sure, sure. Next attacking gnome will heal for 50% of damage dealt once per battle. Heal 4 damage, it applies weak times 2. Press 2 gnomes, and applies a drunk times 3 to hero. Okay, I think we grab Screwinator and Speedy. Armor's cool and all, but I can't really afford to put you in the deck. Okay. I really hope that next one is going to give us sausages because we are out. All right. What do we got? Free attack. Another free attack. 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 The two, the machine gun's probably not worth it using without the crit, to be honest. Okay, what do we got here? Blast ya. Blast ya. Mana. Okay. He's healing, which is annoying. Increase the damage by 50%. Increase the damage to sure. Give ourselves armor. And we apply mark to you. Be okay, Boomer, you're to get two mana back. We blast you for 15, which also crits, and you're dead. Okay, that was a pretty strong turn. Probably should have killed that guy. <laughs> okay, we have armor. No, you need armor. Give us some mana. You're not worth using. You're hitting for 13. Okay, Beatty. Uh, okay. Sure. Ouch. Now weaken you. I'm gonna have a cell to dodge just so I know what it does. Fifty percent chance to avoid damage. That's pretty good gonna blast you and we're gonna move on 
deals 10 damage at chain to the wagon. I don't know what that means. And also, I feel like you should be yellow. Another juggler would be pretty rad. Are we going to be able to move? Because we're like out of food. Apparently, yes. Are our gnomes starving? What's happening here? Covered a stone sculpture of a dwarf. That looks like a gnome, my friend. Unclear if it's a burial site or an altar. Respectfully acknowledge and thank your ancestors for their influence nonetheless. Gain experience or train two gnomes. What is experience? Um, I guess experience? Okay. Statue's eyes glow blue, and a voice booms from inside of it. Remembering the heroes of the past is the wisdom of the heroes of the present. Sure. What, uh... We're out of sausages. Some of the gnomes in the squad have fainted and cannot go into battle. How do I get more? I guess probably at the sausage points? <laughs> Do I get to know which ones are not in battle? Uh, okay. Hmm. I think that we blast the cat. I don't feel good about it. I love cats. We blast you again. You're dead. And we get our mana back. Okay, you're buffing yourself up several times by the looks of it. Um, self dodge, speedy, mana, 12 damage. You're dead next turn, my friend. 21 damage. Woo! Jeez Louise. Too bad you're dead. Too bad you're dead. Thank you. <laughs> okay strength times two sounds good let's do it is this an elite if so i'm worried <laughs> doesn't look super strong maybe it's like waves of battle i'm not sure okay I think that I know you do a ton of damage, so why don't we do this? Sure. Get back to full. All right. Strength times two. Okay. You are now dead. How about we do this? Give ourselves 50% chance to dodge. Okay. It's pretty good. We missed one of them. Or they missed one of them, I should say. Hmm. We could give ourselves more strength. Last, yeah.
Then that. We blast you. We heal again. My immune. I think we end there. We don't want Mark for a second turn. Did immune just remove? If so, that's huge news. Okay. We are going to hit you there. Hit you there. Blast you. And as long as we kill you with a ranged, we get out. Applies immune to all enemies and debuffs them. That doesn't make much sense to me. Based on what I know about immune. Slingshot sniper, sure. Okay. Rot of sausages, sure, sure, sure. Quest. At sunset, a gnomes arrive at your camp who escaped a nearby human outpost. He said that his entire detachment was scheduled to be executed by the humans the next morning. Well, we gotta help him. Your field doctor is dealing with the escapee and you need to decide what to do. Maybe a trap or maybe your brothers are really endangered. Uh, nah, dude. We gotta save the gnomes, dude. Gotta end the oppressive regime of Snow White, baby. Uh, you approach the outpost and see torches flickering inside, casting an eerie glow. When you sneak inside, you immediately grasp the situation. The prisoner's escape has alarmed the guards and they are hastily preparing an execution tonight. Okay. I mean, we gotta get to our buddy. Make your way towards the jail cell and discover four gnomes behind bars. Three guards watch over them. Hmm. Stun them. Okay. Strong skull. You hate to see it. You're a beefy boy. Okay, you're going to armor up. Hmm. I'm going to help you armor up. I got news for you, my friend. You're going to die, like, soon. <laughs> um. Excuse me? Get out. Easy peasy. You defeat the guard, but the sound of the battle alerts the other humans in the fortress. You managed to release the prisoners, but you are now surrounded. Uh-oh. Oh, and I got four random gnomes added to my deck. That's not... Fantastic. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, we know Archer Man does a ton of damage. Okay, to the front. Speedy. Uh, blast ya. Weaken ya. Heals 5 HP, applies drunk. I assume that's bad. Okay. Interesting. Uh, we're going to give you two strength. We're going to get one back. We're going to blast you for nine. What happens when you get a bunch of armor? I'm a little bit worried about that. Um. Okay, I wanted that grit. That's unfortunate. We need more mana gnomes, dude. We just save our mana, honestly. Okay, what do we got here? Sure. Would love it if you could crit, but uh, I don't have the mana for that. Sure. 
Sure. Bummer. At least we're cycling our deck. Um... Let's do this first. Let's heal and get slightly intoxicated. And let's give ourselves strength. Should have not done it in that order now that I'm thinking about it, but that's fine. Okay, let us give you Mark. Blast, yeah. Okay, I missed. <laughs> right on that. Fine. All right. Let's give ourselves armor, heal. I think we save it. Do you go away after I heal once? If so, I'd like to use you. Yes, you do. Hey, okay. Come on, dude. You got to give me a mana card soon, right? <laughs> Our deck is way too bloated. Um, sure, we can you up. Oh, I feel like we should save our mana. Okay. Yeah. Let's do this. Yeah. I think that would would have I think that was more damage than what we would have gotten with the other one, is what I was trying to say. Okay. We would like to give ourselves one mana and shoot you. Good stuff. Prisoners fight so ferociously that the humans retreat in horror. This is your chance to escape. You whistle loudly and your comrades on the walls open the gates of the outpost. Run! Here reach level three. Sure. Ah, we got a talent point. At base camp, though. Okay. So that's interesting. So our heroes level up over time, but as we saw, they can die permanently. That's interesting. We've got no sausages. Our people are starving. <laughs> okay. Uh, tell you what. Get wrecked. We're gonna weaken you. We're gonna blast you. Heal. Blast you again. And I don't really want to be drunk. And get blasted. Heals one damage four times. No, thank you. Scarge of Gnome gives two mana. Yes, please. We need mana desperately. Okay, sausages. Uh, train gnomes. I mean, I don't really... We're losing like 40 per time we travel. If we get 100 sausages, that means nothing, dude. Let's train some gnomes. Uh, now, we're not likely to get them, since they're all starving. <laughs> but that's fine. Discard the Gnome gives three mana. Low HP once per battle. Draw two gnomes. Okay. You just get a damage increase. Who cares? Um... Yeah. Pretty 
pretty good. Dean times three is pretty good too. That's also very good. We get to really want to increase the amount of armor that I'm giving to people since I'm using that to crit mostly. It's still bad. Um, okay, here's what I think we do. Constantly out of mana, so mana lad, get upgraded. Gotcha, it doubles in price to upgrade the next one. Did that upgrade all the mana lads? Because if so, that's crazy good. BD. Nope. Mana lads right here. Okay, I think we do another one of you, even though you're not in the deck. And we do another speedy. All of the day. Ooh, and we have enough to buy 100 sausages that are going to be gone in two friggin' <laughs> movements. Yeah, dude. That was not worth it. I guess at the end it's worth it because then you have your entire deck. Okay, what do we got here? We would like to use this, cast this, then we use this, and yeah, I think that's it. Okay. Wow, I got blinded. That is very unfortunate. Okay. Will you forward you didn't because you have armor okay give myself some dodge we're going to kill you to heal and sure let's crit on him nice you love to see the dodge work we're gonna draw a card apply a week Discard two, of course. Okay, we're gonna heal. And then we're gonna blast them. Not too shabby. Elites all targets armor. Deals five damage to target and crit to enemy behind. Your hero loses all armor. Got news for you, my friend. I usually don't have any. <laughs> Let's grab you. Okay. Travel here. Wow. You have a large head, my friend. Um, I have a feeling this cat buffs up over time, so I want to hook you to the front. I should have marked you first. Blast ya, blast ya. You're gonna die from poison. Okay. I think that we... Speedy. And I suppose we just attack twice since we can't do much else. What's your deal, guy? Do you do like a random amount of damage? Um. Okay, you're dead. Get out. Uh, boy. I guess you would be kind of okay since we have strength in our deck. This looks like an elite, maybe. Music is bumping. 
Okay, what do we got? I think we last yeah. We this and this last yeah. You don't have armor, which is a bummer, but it's okay. Last yeah. Get wrecked. deck has gotten kind of good. Uh, it took a while. Okay. Let's kill you to heal. I missed. I got blinded. I think there needs to be a better way to um, keep track of statuses because I generally can't tell. Um, okay. So in that case, we weaken you. I think it's okay to save you so that we can heal since you're not doing anything anyways. Zero damage. Four times. Why? I'm not weakened because I do minus one damage. That is unfortunate. <laughs> Last ya. Heal me. Yeah. And yep, that did what I expected. <laughs> okay. Chained. Tell you what, I'm gonna discard you. You're chained. I'm gonna mark ya. I'm gonna blast ya. Blast ya again. All targets armor deals 8% chance. Next attack now will heal for 50% of damage dealt once per battle. Slingshot sniper me, please. Okay. Hit me with quest. The road curves around a hill, presenting a small caravan of human merchants with cages containing gnomes. The sight of a squadron of armed gnomes surprises humans. What should we do? I mean battle. Let's free our kin. Listen, we don't tolerate slavers and oppressors here. We blast them. Okay, you are going to get armor. Then you're going to get blasted. Again. Again. And now you're nearly dead. Okay, what do we do here? We kill ya. Last ya, no crit. That's fine. Alright. We are going to get there. Get some mana back. Get ya there. Get ya there. And you're dead. Give me my gnomes. I don't actually want more gnomes, but, uh, ooh, EXP, why not? 10 damage once per battle. That's not terrible. Get rid of ya. Just one weak and seven armor can be applied to enemies, sure. Yeah, so we're bloating our deck, but, you know, I gotta save the gnomes, dude. I can't leave the gnomes to be slaves. That's crazy. Okay, you have an actual weapon now instead of a stick with a lock on it. Um, I would love to save this for a crit. That'd be nice. So, we'll hit you because you're weaker. Now you're almost dead, so I kind of want to hit you again. Ouch. We are going to yeah we're gonna kill you we're gonna give ourselves strength okay 
hit you here. Sure. Full mana. Okay, what do we do here? Okay, and just like that, we are at the end. Not too concerned about being 44 out of 50. I think we train a gnome. Oh, it only goes up in that certain location. That's fantastic. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Meh. Let's see what the boss looks like. We get a special gnome if we beat this. Ooh, it could be a new hero now that I think about it. Okay. You are significantly... You're like the size of my entire Wagner, dude. You're huge. Uh, okay. Let's give you armor. Let's blast ya. Okay. I mean, like, 36 damage first turn. It's pretty good. Um. I'm thinking you shield up. We have armor, so let's... Um, I guess just so you don't build up a lot of armor. All right, we get strength. We blast the crap out of you. Get mana back. Blast you again. And we're full mana. Easy peasy. Okay, you don't have armor. Ooh, we finally do uh, because of our strength. Okay, let's hit you. Buy some weak. Beady. Yeah. Heal up a bit and we'll get more mana back. Saving that 10 for a crit. Okay. Not great. Wait, unplayable. Are you adding those to my deck or are those my existing gnomes? This chain seems different than the unplayable one. Uh, well, last ya. Discard you. Yeah, is our deck filling up? 
Maybe that's his jam as he fills us with useless garbage. I don't know what that is. That looks like Mark. <laughs> I think I just messed up pretty bad. Um, let's get rid of this card. Okay. Let us... Deals 9 damage, adds chain to the wagon. Is getting very clogged full of junk. I think I don't play you. Ouch. Um. not worth using. Okay, he's applying a mark to us, which is a huge bummer. Let's do this. Blast him down. Ouch. Okay. We do this. And you're dead. Get out of here, dude. Don't mess with the gnomes. Hell yeah, brother. That was epic. You broke away from the chase and escaped the encirclement. This is the end of the demo version, but in the full version of the game, you can play through the story of the gnomes, Riot, and their battle for freedom. Because you completed this mission, you will receive new gnomes, and you can try and build another starting squad to defeat one of the three possible bosses of this demo. Please add the game to your wish list if you enjoyed it. I agree. Uh, if you want to see more from them, it really helps out developers if you wish list their games. So please do that. Um, I had a fun time. I will say there's a couple quality of life things that I would like to see. I'd like to see tags for um, the various effects that can be put on you. Um, it would be nice to have like a better indication of when statuses are being applied because I frequently didn't notice that I was blind. Um, I don't know. I think the sausage system needs to be reworked a little bit because it's like it didn't really matter till the very end. And also I didn't really see enough sausage spots since we can't skip gnomes for it to like we can't keep it under control. You know what I mean? But yeah, overall, I think I had a fun time. Um, I like the story. It's very cute. It's very funny. And, uh, yeah, there was some interesting stuff going on there. It's cool that you've got heroes that level up over time, but can die permanently. That's pretty neat. And, uh, yeah, overall fun time. I recommend checking it out yourself. I will leave a link to the demo in the description down below. Uh, if you liked the video, I appreciate it. If you left a like, it would help me out a lot. If you want to see more from me? Um, please subscribe. I make several videos a day. Um, putting out, I think, good content. Hopefully you agree. Uh, but yeah, my name is Quantic Flux, and I hope to see you in the next one. Take care, everybody.